Hi guys, welcome to the pin description of 8051 microcontroller. Today, we'll be talking specifically about the 889S52 microcontroller. It is an 8051 family microcontroller having 40 pins in total. It is a low power high performance 8 bit microcontroller with 8 k bytes of in system programmable flash memory. So let's begin. So over here at pin 40, we have the VCC pin and over at uh, pin 20, we have the ground pin. So these are the power pins of the 8051 microcontroller. At the VCC pin, we provide 5 volts and at the ground pin, we provide 0 volts. So after that, uh, as you can see, the 8051 has uh, 4 ports, port 0, port 1, port 2 and port 3. Apart from these 4 ports, the 8051 also has uh, 2 crystal pins, the XTAL1 and the XTAL2. So these pins uh, are connected to our uh, crystal. And uh, standard is 11.0592 uh, megahertz crystal with uh, two 33 picofarad capacitors. So those three components form the crystal oscillator circuit for the 889s52. Okay, so after that, uh, over here, just below P1.7, we have the RST pin, which is the reset input for 8051. So if you provide a high over this pin, then the 8051 will get reset and your program will reset so this uh, brings us uh, halfway through to the explanation but uh, before we go into further details I'd like to address a common query many viewers have come across this question so where is to buy the 8051 and uh, what's the pricing so over here I have a link that you can refer so you can just visit nivonexpress.com and uh, over there if you want to select this uh, controller then just uh, search over here in the search bar search for 889s52 and after that in order to know the price just select your country for example uh, we are selecting USC for example let's see so this gives us the price for US Let's check out for UK. So this is the price for UK, and now let's check the price for India. So as you can see, this control is available for uh, very cheap prices online over here at uh, newonexpress.com, and you can get it for uh, 95 rupees per piece. If you compare it with uh, other websites, for example, uh, Amazon.in, then uh, you shall see that uh, at Amazon, it is available for uh, costlier prices, but uh, you can get the same thing at uh, cheaper rates comparatively over here. So let's get back with the explanation. Okay. So after that, uh, there are three of these pins, the EA pin, the ALE pin and the PSEN pin. So these pins have uh, special functions. The EA means external access enable. So what happens is that uh, this pin also receives 12 volt programming enable voltage during flash programming. After that we have the PSEN, the program store enable pin. So that is used for uh, programming. Then we have the ALE or the probe pin. So the ALE means the address latch enable or the program pulse input so this takes care of uh, all of the pins of the 8051 microcontroller but there are still certain pins which have special functions let's go through them so over here at uh, P1.0 there's a T2 pin so the T2 is the external count input to the timer or counter 2 then we have the T2 EX pin just below that so that is uh, timer or counter to capture or reload trigger and direction control after that at uh, p1.5 we have the MOSI and there is a uh, p1.6 we have the MISO and there is an SCK at uh, p1.7 so these three pins form the serial peripheral interface of the 8051 microcontroller 
After that, we also have the RXD and THD pins at uh, P3.0 and P3.1. Now, these RXD and THD pins are used for serial communication with the microcontroller. After that, uh, we have the INT0 and the INT1 pins at P3.2 and P3.3 respectively. So, these are the hardware interrupts for the 8051 microcontroller. Then, we have the T0 and T1 which are the timer 0 external input and the timer 1 external input. Then, we have the WR bar and the read bar. So, these are the external data memory write and the external data memory read. So, this takes care of the pin description of uh, 8051. So, when you want to refer the pin details of 889S5 to microcontroller, then you can just uh, simply visit this uh, website e1express.com and you can have the details of the pin diagram as well as the pin description over here. Do subscribe to stay updated. Also, check out our collection of 8051 project ideas. Don't forget to check out our tutorials of other microcontrollers and sensors. Thank you. Have a good day.